Now, let me show you how to save your own presets. But before going there, let's first build up a chain of models and effects, and then I'll show you how to save it as presets. For an amp tone model, I really like this model over here, which is based on a Mesa Boogie dual rectifier, and it's going into a Mesa Recto traditional cab. Now I want to do some changes to it. I don't need as much gain, so I'm going to pull the gain down. And then pump up the treble maybe and pull back the mids. I want to use a different cab, so I'm going to click on here and I like this cab called a pushed soup. Let's take that out there, pushed supra. And this is based off a Fender Super Reverb cab. So that sounds like this now. Now, how about adding some compression? I'll arm that, pull up some threshold, reduce the gain, and we got this. And some reverb. For the reverb, let's go for a plate reverb, change the color to a brighter reverb, increase some of the mix, and have a bit of pre-delay. I'm happy with that. So now when I want to save the preset of what I've built up, I can just click over here. It brings up the Save Preset dialog window, and I can insert some information here. So let's give the preset a name. I'll call it Gary Misa Amp Vendor Cab. That'll give me a good indication of what's being used there. Now, the author is who originally modeled the amp. So this was originally modeled by RK Multimedia. So it's going to show the so it's going to show the original author there. Then if it was based on any stomp box, it'll include here. I'll leave these details on the amp. So that was pulled from the original author. Then I can give some information on the instrument. So this is going to be for an electric guitar using the bridge pickup. And then I could also add some information for song info and a description, but I don't really need to fill these out right now. I'll click save. Now, if I go to the presets, it's showing my new preset there. If it didn't show it, I could go to the search functionality and search for it. And it narrows down and shows my newly created preset. So there is the name for the preset. Here is what's included in the chain, which is a noise gate, an amp head, a speaker cab, some compression and reverb. The character is high gain, and then it's going to the Mesa Boogie Dual Rectifier Amp into a Fender Super Reverb. If you're not happy with your preset, you can click over here and delete it. So that is how to create your own presets from building up models and adding some effects and changing them and then saving them as your own unique presets.